Putiva has been in the market for about 11 years, uh, initially providing solutions for electronic top-up. Um, and working with some of our customers, we realized that uh, that distribution engine, uh, an agent network, can uh, uh, facilitate mobile payments. Uh, so customers like uh, Gcash in Philippines uh, that launched uh, mobile payments back in 2005 has uh, proven to be a very uh, successful ecosystem and business model to enable the own bank population uh, to be able to uh, uh, do transactions uh, over the phone. Uh, and we're targeting about uh, 2.5 billion inhabitants in the world, people, that uh, today still don't have access to uh, mobile financial services or to financial services. Um, one, one example of uh, that uh, on how mobile payments uh, facilitate the life of, uh, of uh, a person is, for example, farmers in Philippines. Uh, farmers in Philippines, uh, basically today, they can access uh, a small line of credit um, that once it's approved, uh, they can receive the reimbursement of that line of credit in their mobile wallet, so they don't need to travel four or five hours to the bank branch to, uh, to get, receive that, and they can repay that. And once they have the money in the wallet, they can also pay their suppliers, uh, the, uh, the pesticides, the seeds, uh, all, the, all those suppliers also receive that. And some communities in the Philippines, uh, in the rural areas, are almost cashless because all the transactions are made uh, in this way. The overall market uh, today, uh, based on recent uh, surveys on the industry, is about 350, 400 billion um, uh, dollars uh, globally. That includes uh, mobile commerce uh, transactions uh, in developed markets. But uh, we see that market is going to grow uh, fast. And by the end of 2004, uh, we we expect the industry expect that the the industry will be about 900 billion dollars. Today, as, as you mentioned, it's a closed loop uh, implementation. So those users can only transact with other users within that closed loop. So in a particular country, by a particular operator or a particular bank that is offering the service. The importance of the convergence, uh, uh, the strategy, and the agreement with MasterCard is that it's going to allow us to enable those users to start transacting with an open loop, meaning that they can transact to any other users that is connected to that open loop which is basically every MasterCard card holder and all their mobile payments ecosystem that will be connected to that MasterCard worldwide network. Uh, and that's going to uh, trigger a significant volume of transactions because the, the uh, transability between bank and non-bank uh, population.